Are you looking for the best webcams for streaming? In this video we will look at some of the 7 best webcam on the market. Before we get started with our video. We have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Razer Keo Pro Streaming Webcam. I was very skeptical before seeing this camera in action because it is a bit expensive for a webcam. However, I can say that the quality is better than basically any $200 point and shoot camera I've seen. This is a high-end webcam that has a fast f/2.0 lens made of Gorilla Glass 3, one of the strongest glass materials out there, and can record up to 1080p at 60 frames per second. It also has HDR, which is a vital feature of any modern camera. I personally didn't know they made webcams with it already, but that's great. This means that no matter what lighting situation you are in, the camera will adapt to it and make sure your face looks bright. I like the fact that it's made with Gorilla Glass, so it's a camera that should last you for a long time, even if you travel with it a lot. There's really nothing bad about it, except the price. Still, it is fair for what you get. Nowadays the cheapest mirrorless cameras don't get any lower than $500, so you'd still need to invest a lot more to get better quality and a movable camera. At Number 2. Logitech VRIO. This is one of the two only cameras in this list capable of doing 4K video. That's an impressive feat for a webcam, especially after seeing that it isn't the most expensive one on this list. So why isn't it in the first place? The reason is that 4K isn't the most important thing for content creation. Most new YouTubers and Twitch streamers don't even get the ability to upload in 4K. We chose the Razer Keo Pro instead, because it offers a lens with a wider field of view, so it makes it easier to show your surroundings if you want to. Also, it is more durable than the Logitech Brio thanks to the Gorilla Glass. However, you have to take into account that the Razer webcam is more expensive. The BRIO, besides the 4K, also gives you a fast f/2.0 lens and HRD. This means that low-light situations won't be an issue. The camera adapts well to low light and will make sure you look well in most situations. It's still a bit pricey for a webcam, but most webcams don't come with these features, so it's still a fair price. At number 3. Avermedia PW513. This one is very similar to the Logitech BRIO, as it can also record 4K at 30 frames per second and 1080p at 60 frames per second. The main differences are that the lens has a slower aperture of f/2.8 and that it does not have HDR. The Avermedia, however, has a better built-in microphone. It's omnidirectional, but with AI-powered noise reduction. Out of all the webcams I've seen, this one has the better audio. However, how important are these features? Two things. You shouldn't be relying on HDR on any camera, because you should always use lighting if you're a content creator on YouTube. Even a cheap ring light should be enough. And the same thing could be said about audio quality. You should always have a good microphone for YouTube. Finally, the field of view of this camera is pretty similar to the BRIOs. It's only larger by 4 degrees, 94 instead of 90 degrees. If you want to have more control over what people can see around you, the Razer webcam is still the winner with a FOV of 103 degrees. This stands strong as a third option though. It all depends on how much you want to rely on external lighting and mics. At Number 4. Logitech HD Pro C920. It really does not matter where you look, the Logitech HD Pro C920 is the best webcam for the price. This is due to its impressive recording quality for such a webcam, I haven't found another webcam that can match this one in quality in this price range. If you're a streamer or plan to record gaming videos and have a tight budget, you are probably going to buy this camera. There are not many reasons not to do so. Its focus is automatic and it can record 1080p at 30 frames per second. The image quality doesn't feel like it's coming from a webcam. And T can tilt and pan and it does deliver good quality. One of the biggest features this camera has is that you can mount it on a tripod. You don't have to hang your webcam over your monitor like the rest, 
you can instead choose the best place for your camera and use a small tabletop tripod. If you combine this camera with a good USB microphone, you can start recording high-quality videos for a low cost. And one last tip, do not think the C930 or C922 are better than this one just because they're newer. The truth is that they're all very similar. I would still recommend this one over any of those two. The problem is that it's often out of stock because of how popular it is. The others do have their own small advantages, but this has been the king of cheap webcams for years, and it seems it will continue to be so for a long time. At number 5. Logitech C922. Once Logitech realized that most Twitch streamers were buying the C920, they decided to release a tailored version for them. That's the Logitech C922. Now, the camera recording quality itself is basically the same as the C920 which is available for less. But it has additional incentives for vloggers. The most important one is a feature that can remove the background, doing what a green screen is supposed to do. The camera can recognize human shapes and it removes everything else, so you can use any background you want to. As you can see, it can be helpful if you don't have a green screen background, but it is not good enough to completely replace it. On the other hand, it's worth mentioning that it can record 720p at 60 frames per second, while the C920 is capped at 30 frames per second. Still, it can only record at 30 frames per second in 1080p, so it's unlikely you'll be using this feature. Finally, this version comes with a 6-month X split license if you buy it on Amazon. This is a streaming software that is preferred by some over the popular and free OBS that most streamers use. The price difference isn't that big, but try to determine if you'll really find these features useful. You can still get the C920 in a cheap backdrop, and you will get a better result with the background removal if you do it right. You can also use a high-quality green screen that you can store easily instead, like Elgato's portable screen. At Number 6. Razer Kio Streaming Webcam This is the lower version of the Razer Kio Pro webcam. It's more similar to a Logitech C920, but the big selling point is the integrated ring light. This can save you a lot of space and a bit of money. It can still do 1080p at 30 frames per second, and the quality is very similar to the C920. It's not a very durable camera, and the light can break easily if dropped, so it's not a camera I'd recommend a lot for travel. If you choose this over the C920, do it because of the ring light. If you use good lighting with both of these cameras, the C920 has slightly better autofocus, and it feels more durable. Designed and tested by top streamers, the Razer Kio is a desktop streaming camera with a powerful, multi-step ring light that you can dim or brighten on command, and the ability to stream at 60 frames per second for full gaming fidelity. It's the perfect camera for professional streaming. Microphone Sensitivity, minus 38 dB. At number 7. Logitech C930E. This one is a small upgrade from the C920, but it's a lot more expensive. It has UVC H.264, which means that all the encoding process will be done by the camera, it doesn't need to use your PC's resources. It also includes the 4x zoom and has a wider 90-degree pan. Some users have reported having compatibility problems and the camera being slower. This is why I tend to still recommend the C920 as the first option, if you can find it new. After all, you are paying more for a camera that doesn't feel like it comes with any significant improvement. Logitech C930 E1080 p HD Video Webcam 90 Degree Extended View, Microsoft Link 2013 and Skype Certified. High Speed USB 2.0 Certified, USB 3.0 Ready. Certified for Microsoft Link 2013 and Skype, compatible with most UC and web conferencing applications. This business product comes in brown box and does not ship with retail software, e.g. the Logitech webcam software found in the retail product, for example in Logitech HD Pro Webcam C920.